Hey guys, I want to show you a uh, two uh, screen recorder. The one I found on the um, for lineups to if you want to share your gameplay for Minecraft or other uh, video games or just want to uh, share what you know uh, from the screen of your computer or Chromebook. Uh, one is the Kazam, this one over here, Kazam, and the other one is the simple screen recorder. Uh, but I found, uh, I think I tend to uh, like the simple screen recorder uh, because you can uh, set the, uh, the quality of the video. Because uh, the Chromebook is not a very powerful computer, so normally I want to uh, use uh, less uh, intense uh, for, for my CPU, so the, the CPU can uh, still use many uh, of the resources to uh, for rendering the, the graphics for Minecraft or other video games. So if you open uh, Kassan, this is what it looks like. So you can... Uh, uh, <coughs> You can um, uh, specify the, uh, the speakers, the microphone, and then there's comment on splash. And on screencast over here, you can specify the frame rate, the record, uh, there's automatic file saving on, and then you can specify the directory and the file name prefix. Uh, but over here, there is no, um, you cannot set the quality of your video. So I just want to show you, uh, I'm going to open Minecraft here, okay? And then later you can compare the, the quality. Um, both are set up to 30 frames per second. And this is just an open world here. So um, you can be um, the judge for yourself, which one would you choose? Sometimes um, for a different computer and for different um, resources that you have on your computer, it will kind of work differently. So you might want just to test it on your own. Um, Right now I'm playing over here, it's kind of smooth, it's showing like 12 frames per second. Uh, yeah. Um. Okay, so this is the second uh, screen recorder for the uh, Linux. The, the first one, the uh, one I showed to you is, is Kazam. And then this is the second one, is the simple screen recorder. This is what it looks like. Um, and then I already turned it on. So, and this is, um, I'm, I'm just gonna show it to you. Uh, I'm gonna open this again, what it looks like. So, and then you press continue. And then uh, I mentioned earlier, I like this one better because uh, you can actually specify the, uh, um, the besides the frame rate, you know, you can press by the frame rate too, record the entire screen too, and then there's also this uh, record open GL. Um, I still haven't really tried, but tried this one, but I think it, uh, it's gonna work also with Minecraft. I'm not sure, I, I haven't uh, really tried it. And the audio also, you can specify the, uh, the, the source and everything, and then after that, you can click continue, and then the codec. It's the same as the Kazam. You can specify whether it hits 264 or what have you. I just put it as default. Uh, the container, I just put it as default too. MKV, uh, it doesn't really matter. And this is the one I like, the constant rate factor. Uh, it's by default, it's 23. So um, this one you can, uh, if you want to have a, a higher quality video, then you have to uh, make it lower. You uh, make it 18 or, or 13 but I think your computer is gonna work really hard because of that so uh, you just play uh, play with this and see uh, which uh, give you the best result and then there's a preset super fast this one is also about the encoding speed so it says the higher speed use less CPU so this is already super fast if you click down it's like one below the the fastest which is the ultra fast the default so I, I didn't change that one um, I know the uh, the Chromebook uh, doesn't have a very powerful CPU at least uh, the one I'm using right now is the HP 14 um, so I'm just using uh, the default which is super fast um, which is uh, using uh, less CPU power um, and then this is the audio also I just put it the default 128 kilo uh, bit per second and when you click continue but um, it's already recording right now so when you click continue 
um, this is what it looks like basically so this is what it looks like and then there's a start recording and then you press it and then you can actually monitor here there's the total time here it's uh, still recording to 47 seconds the frame, frame per second this is the one that you uh, specify 30 and then the frame per second out this is the one that's going out uh, the result of that so actually uh, when I open Minecraft the frame per second is gonna reduce right now I haven't opened Minecraft see so I'm gonna open Minecraft right now all right and then just back to game all right okay and then I will show it to you uh, I'm gonna put that one at the front so you can see all right um, oops uh, I cannot do that let me see probably I can minimize this and then I can bring this to the front like that or wait I'll put it somewhere here beside by side here so you can monitor it um, all right now we are on the same so you can see so now it's still good now you can see the frame per second there the FPS out is reduced now it's like only nine eight nine yes so yeah it's not 30 but um, it seems quite smooth you know it's not 30 frame per second it's the maximum is like probably like 15 16 I'm gonna um, maximize this okay Okay. All right. All right. So um, yes, those are the two screen recorders so far I found. Uh, I think I like the uh, the simple screen recorder better, and uh, then the Kasam is just it it works for me. But you wanna might wanna try the different things. Uh, there's another uh, screen recorder I found. It's called Focus Screen, but it doesn't work um, for some reason. I don't know why. And there is another screen recorder on the Google Chrome. I'm just going to show you it quickly on the browser. If you open the browser here, um, it's called Screencastify. This one, this icon over here. Yeah, this is what it looks like. It's very simple to use, but unfortunately, uh, it makes also the uh, the the frame per second quite low too. So um, probably I can show it to you uh, to compare it. So <clears throat> so that's the uh, Kazam. I'm just gonna end this right now, and then I'm gonna compare it uh, with you with the screencastify and you can judge for yourself which one is the better solution for you okay let me stop this I'm not sure how to stop this um, all right safe recording yeah you just click the safe recording okay so right now I'm uh, showing you the third uh, software to uh, record your gameplay or to record your screen it's called the Screencastify. It's under the Google Chrome. It's under the extension, under your extension. So uh, this is the icon here on the top, um, over here, top uh, right, um, you can see here. Uh, it's very simple to use. Um, you just set up the resolution uh, uh, you want, uh, the frame per second you want, and even has the webcam. So that's why now you can see my beautiful face over here excuse me um this is what i like but uh it's very simple it's the the simplest uh, user interface you don't even have to set up uh, what kind of audio uh a format audio codec you don't have to uh, set up the uh, what kind of uh, video format whether whether it's mp4 fei you just click on the resolution uh, that you want whether 720p or lower than that and you just uh, also uh, specify the frame per second you want in this case i just put it uh, 30 frame per second but of course, it just it doesn't want to record uh, 30 frames per second. Uh, right now, it's only recording like nine, ten. But the beautiful thing about this is it's very simple. The user interface and there's a web camera, so you guys can see this face. You know, if you want to show your face or you're not afraid to show your face, come on, just show your face. It's fine. Uh, people will love your face. Uh, um, 
So I'm just going to show it to you how it plays on Minecraft. Okay, I'm going to open Minecraft right now. Um, this is again, it's a it's a single player Minecraft. I'm not uh, using any um, any server, and it's, it runs pretty good here. Uh, but I do not know what it looks like on the playback. I mean, still like about 10, 13. If I if I stop, it's about 11, 16. So it's about as good as the the simple screen recorder. Um, you know, uh, if I go down here, oh, I kill myself. Oh! I go to the water. I drown myself here. Oh no! Oh no! It's actually it's pretty pretty good. Um, but you'll be the judge. You can try on your own uh, which one works for you. All right. So those are the three um, screen recorder that you can uh, uh, try. One is the uh, the Kazam here. The, uh, the second is a simple screen recorder. And the third one is under the Google Chrome. It's the Screencastify. So if you want to, uh, let me just show you real quick. So this first two, the simple screen recorder and the Kasam is under the Ubuntu. So you have to install um, using the Ubuntu or Linux, uh, 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 what do you call that, a command. But uh, for the the third uh, applications or the third uh, screen recorder is called Screencastify. It's under the uh, Google uh, Chrome browser. So if you want to install, this is the easiest to install. You just go to this. Um, the right top here, the like the three lines, and then you go under uh, settings, and then you go under extension, and then you scroll down. So this is the name of the Screencastify, screen video recorder, um, and then you go get more extension, and then you just uh, type the Screencastify on the search bar, and then you just click install. That's it. It's very simple. Well, uh, the other two because it's under the uh, Linux uh, operating system, it's kind of uh, more uh, complicated. You have to type in uh, like three comments, which I'm going to provide on the description later on if you want to try it. So um, yeah, that's all. Give me give me your thoughts, uh, which one works for you. And if you have uh, uh, a solutions to my problem, because I'm trying to also to make this thing work, the four uh, applications, which is called Focus Screen, but I couldn't make it work. Uh, the problem is every time I uh, play the start button, it immediately uh, just turn off. You know, I play start, turn off, start, turn off. It's just stop immediately. So it doesn't want to record. So those are the three uh, uh, screen recorder that works for me. But I think I like uh, if I have to choose for very uh, simplicity, I like the, uh, the, of course, the screen classify. And it, of course, can show uh, my face with a webcam like this. But it's really up to you. All right. So um, thank you for watching. See you uh, next time.